Hey guys, Dante2. Back with more Final Fantasy IV. My throat's feeling a little bit better now. I just had to... Wanted to take a breather. And for some reason, those chests down there are unopened. I don't know why. It's the library. Can't meet the king until you've defeated the queen. Then how does Rydia know the king? Well, I guess he kind of did abduct her. But whatever. Wonder if humans have the skill to wield our weapons. Let's find out. Blitz whip. Lightning. Very good upgrade for her. Oh, I can't get the Kinesis staff down here. And uh, completely useless arrows. Um. Fuck. I need to sell some things. Uh, sell the five kill. That's hilarious. Uh, Kotetsu. Uh, I want to keep the Oichi's bow. Huh? I thought I already got one. Oh, I got the arrows. That's what I got. I want to keep the Oichi's bow because it's probably the best bow in the game at this point. And it's the only one that's actually worth a crap. Hmm. I don't think there's anything else I really can get rid of at this point. Uh... Wait, I can sell off these Garshal Greens. Because I have a fat Chocobo in my ship. And yeah, I think I'm good. Uh, let's sort those items. <clears throat> And I want to grab... I know I want to grab one Kinesis Staff. And one Fairy Rod. For Palom and Palm, when I uh, bring them back into my party. So I can have them use that until they get their better weapons. And what is in the armor shop? Here. Ooh, Aegis Shield. Uh, yeah, Cecil needs that. And let's grab two light robes. Yeah, Cecil needs the shield badly. Ah, <laughs> uh, I hate this about the game. <laughs> I can't just hit best equipment. Uh... Oh, Blitz Whip, I can get rid of that. Well, no, I can't. Uh, I might as well just sell something. What did I just unequip from her? Uh, the Ice Shield, that's what I unequipped. Behold the horrors and dra horror and drama of equipping your items. I apologize for this. I will have more things to talk about in just a moment. All right, one second. Actually, I'll meet you outside. <sighs> Actually, just give me a second. There. Restarted my timer. So I forgot to because I'm an idiot. Anyway. Actually, now that I have all this stuff, I am delaying the inevitable. Get out of my way, bomb. 
Seriously. Thank you. Back up here, get in the tent. Well, not in the tent, but save. Because we are going to go face the queen. Queen Asura. Uh, name the ways up there. <laughs> uh, I thought there was something in here. It said that there are still other forms of sun magic that lay undiscovered. Actually, huh. If that's in the original game, then that's a hint to something later. Yeah, that's that's actually kind of strange. And this just talks about uh, the summons that she has. Titan. Great physical and mental strength. Answer a that leads to the world of humans. So magic. And okay, no. But still, that one up at the top, that's quite strange. I'll get I'll go more into it later when we actually get to it, but that surprises me that that's there, and if that is there in the original, then maybe they had something planned out for a while. Odin. He was only defeated when his sword was struck by a bolt of lightning. Sakasai has a lethal attack that wipes out all enemies in a single blow. That's not... That's not entirely correct. You can survive it. But you have to be really high level. King of Summons. These are all the summons that we can get in the game. Asura, Queen of Summons. Uh, only then you can see King's true form. And a summons regulation. I must prove their own worth. Uh, can I? No, there's nothing there. God of Summons created us. The God of Summons watches over us from afar. The only way to defeat him is to re reflect his own strength against him. Two moons. In the ancient sky, the two were one. Sleep deep within a dragon. Summons monsters, humans. What happened in the past? Hold up, I want to see what that other bookshelf says. If scan fails to indicate the nature of monsters, bestiary may be handy on these. Yeah, bestiary has slightly better accuracy than scan. We may approach the king. Okay, so we have to go to Queen of Sura. We need your help. Okay. Yes. Let us fight. Holy shit, you're a hidden new deity, I think. I think that's what it's based off of. I'm not sure. But anyway, this is Asura. Asura is kind of like white magic master, sort of. She's going to use a lot of defensive stuff, and she's going to heal herself, I believe. So you're going to want to vary your attacks, because she's going to use both shell and protect. Uh, self is going to help a lot here. She's going to counterattack. I think she counterattacks randomly with her heads. Not sure about that. But actually, I just had an idea. If I can get this off on her, this will help a lot. Since I have Sylph now, I can use that as my offensive variety. I don't need black magic. So I should be able to get Reflect on her. And then anything she tries to put on herself will be reflected to me. Because God, she hits hard. Why is she using life? Uh, let's hope this works.
Ah, Cecil. Potion on you. So we'll recover some health. Please don't hit Cecil. God damn it. Do I have full life yet? Probably not. Nope, not even close. Yeah, that's your main problem here. She's gonna counterattack, and those counterattacks hurt. Uh, I want to see if Kane will do any more damage because I don't think his jump attack gets doubled unless he's wielding a spear. I attack you, and now I heal you. Fear me. Self. And Slow's not really going to help too much in this fight, mainly because she's mostly counterattacking. So she's not really going to do anything independent. And I was hoping uh, Kane would get in the air before that went off. Oh well. I went from like Kane Yang to Edge to Kane. Oh, and that's one word. Actually, let's try a little something here. So she really only seems to be used. I don't think she has any offensive uh, spells or uh, other attacks. So I think uh, Blink Ability might actually be able to help here. So yeah, let's set that up. Yep. I think Ridey has got like three protects on her. Speaking of which, I can actually get protect up now that I'm not keeping Cecil alive. experience and we gain her summoned when summoned in battle Asura will randomly cast uh, protect Kiraga or I believe life or full life on your entire party so aside from the last one it's not really that useful and you have a one in three chance of getting it right so it's not very good uh, we can go fight uh, Leviathan now but I am going to pop back up to the surface because 
Leviathan is a water dragon, and as any good Pokemon trainer knows, water is weak to electricity. So I think it's time to assemble the mages and go kick some ass. And by assemble the mages, I mean go get uh, Palom and possibly... No, I'm going to keep Rose in my party for now, I think. Just because I don't have their upgraded equipment. Uh, I need a tent. That is what I need. Where the hell are my tents? Oh, I'm finally out of them? Uh, apparently, I'll start using cottages now. Cottages just heal, I think, a little bit more. I'm not sure. Oh, well. And, actually... Hmm. Next time... Uh, how do I get out? Where's the exit? I forget. Oh yeah, now I remember. Technically I could teleport out, but I'd rather just take that exit. Conserve my stuffs. Next time, I've... Would you move? Thank you. So next time about three times now. Alright, now that we're out. Next time, we're gonna go drop off that... We're gonna go uh, do what we need to do with that rat tail. Grab up Palum and go down there and fry us some water dragon. With electricity. And take what we get from the rat tail to where it needs to go. So, see you guys then. And I'll cut this when I get to the studio.